Freedom Scientific, a Vespero brand. For this next task, we're going to talk about how to share a file in either chat or screen sharing areas. Now, instead of sharing a file, like attaching it to a message or sharing the actual file, it's going to share a link to a file using a cloud service like Google Drive or OneDrive or even Dropbox. Let's go to the chat window with Alt H, Hotel. Alt H, Chat. Now I'm going to shift tab until I get to file. Type message, more chat options, button drop, emoji button, file button drop down. And I'll press space to activate this button. Space, context menu, Dropbox. And here it gives me a few options. I have Dropbox. I can navigate this with my arrow keys. Let's see what the next one is. Microsoft OneDrive, Google Drive, Box, Microsoft SharePoint, Dropbox. So you have several options there. I'm going to go down here to OneDrive. Microsoft OneDrive. Now, when you choose one of these options, you press enter on it. And when that happens, you will probably, at least the first time, be prompted to connect your Zoom account to that service. So I'm going to press enter. Enter key, leaving menus. OneDrive Zoom, Google Chrome FS, OneDrive Zoom, page has no links, OneDrive Zoom, Zoom. Now I'm going to down arrow on this page and see what we have. Cloud icon graphic, connect to OneDrive, connect button. Now it's telling me to connect to OneDrive, so I'm going to press the space bar. Space, OneDrive Zoom, cloud icon graphic, sign in Zoom, main content, main region. Now it wants me to sign in, so here I would type my username and password. I'm going to actually sign in via Google, so I'm going to see if I can... Navigate past these edit fields here. Password, password, edit required. I'm going to down arrow. Password, got password, sign in button. By signing in, I link Zoom's privacy statement and link terms of service. Stay signed in, checkbox checked. Stay signed in or sign in with. All right, so there I could type in a, a Zoom uh, credential there, an email address and password. I'm going to keep going down here so that I can sign in using Google. Sign in with SSO button. Sign in with Apple button. Sign in with Google button. And I'll press space. Alert, required item, email address, please enter your email address, sign in with Google button, sign in Google accounts, to continue, Google will share your name, email address, language preference, sign. So here it will list the Google accounts that I have. I'm going to go ahead and do a find using the find command control F. Virtual find, JAWS find dialog. And I'm going to type FS because the account is FS trainers. FS, enter, link FS trainers. All right, and I'm there, and I'm going to press space. Space, FS Trainers, Trainers 2 at gmail.com, link, sign a Google accounts, Google Chrome, OneDrive, Zoom, Google Chrome, FS, Frame, Cloud Icon, Graphic. Now that we're connected, we are on a page here. It's a OneDrive page with a list of folders and files. I could navigate this page to find the file that I'm looking for, but instead I'm going to go ahead and use that find command again, control and the letter F as in Foxtrot. Virtual find, JAWS find dialog, find what, edit combo. And I'm going to type in blog because I want to look for a blog post that I'm going to share in the chat. B L O G. And I'm, I'm going to press enter. Enter. Blog post March 2022 Freedom Scientific Student of the Month. Docs. And now I am on this blog post. I can verify that with press by pressing insert up arrow. Blog post March 2022 Freedom Scientific Student of the Month. Docs. Two errors. And I can press enter. Enter icon info circle. This file will be shared to the Zoom through a shareable link. Who can access this link? Anyone in your organization only available for Microsoft Work slash school accounts. Anyone with the link cancel choose. So now I can decide who can access this link. I'm going to press down arrow to navigate through these options. Who can access this link? Anyone in your organization only available for Microsoft Work slash school accounts. Checkbox checked. So anyone in my organization and it's telling me because it's OneDrive only people from within this organization here. Uh, can access and I'm going to leave it there. Uh, that is checked. I'm going to down arrow. Anyone in your organization only available for Microsoft Work slash school accounts. Anyone with the link checkbox not checked. Here it says anyone with the link. So let's say there's someone I want to share this with who is not within this organization. I can check this with the space bar. Space, anyone with the link checkbox checked. And let's down arrow. Anyone with the link cancel button, choose button. And I'm going to press space on choose. Space, choose button. Open Zoom meetings dialog HTTPS slash slash us zero six web dot zoom dot us once. And now we have a dialog that is asking us if we want to open the Zoom meeting. Anytime this pops up when you're trying to share something, what it's asking you is do you want to share? So you definitely want to choose open. It's not going to open a new meeting. It's just going to perform the task. So I'm going to up arrow. 
Open Zoom Meetings button. And I'm going to space on Open Zoom Meetings button. Space OneDrive Zoom Google Chrome FS OneDrive Zoom. Now we're back on the OneDrive Zoom page. And that just means, by the way, that Zoom is connected to OneDrive. And that is how you share a link to a file in Zoom. Freedom Scientific, a Vespero brand. To stay up to date on upcoming webinars and training events, complete the sign-up form at freedomscientific.com forward slash webinars. Thanks again for connecting with us.